One Las Vegas man is a full-time pastor and part-time rattlesnake wrangler. Fox's Danny Masson meets up with this multi-talented man when he stopped by to get a snake out of her own yard. This is Tim Agnello in my backyard a few weeks ago when I found this rattlesnake and called Tim for help. Cute. I quickly found out Tim makes himself available to anyone in the community who needs help getting rid of unwanted rattlesnakes and does it all at no cost. I've been into snakes ever since I was a baby. I was catching snakes since I was three years old. And we'll never forget when he caught his first rattlesnake in 1975. This is a baby. This guy will get four feet. When you can hold a rattlesnake in your hand and it's rattling, that's kind of like really fun. Now, this isn't Tim's only passion. I am a full-time pastor. We've been talking about, well, we could serve each other. We certainly need to love each other. By day, Tim preaches the gospel here at Mosaic Church in Henderson. During his spare time, he's a great snake catcher. Mosaic Church here, we just find creative ways to serve our community. And this was one way that I can serve with my own skill set. Tim says more recently during the day and night, he has been busy catching snakes. Whoa, man, once it warmed up a little while ago and we kicked up into the 90s, I was getting like three or four calls a day. I asked Tim what he does with the snakes after catching them. I find a place close by within a mile, take it out into the desert, find a place that's suitable for it, and we'll let it go. There are some things you will want to look out for. Tim says snakes love bushes, shaded areas, and sprinkler systems. So you need rattlesnake fencing, which is, and here in this neck of the woods, it only needs to be three feet high. The rattlesnakes here don't get any larger than three feet. He says if you do encounter a rattlesnake, don't kill it. Rattlesnakes are a very important part of our ecosystem. They keep rodent population down. Um, and so if we take something out of the ecosystem, it, then it puts the ecosystem off balance. And says to call him if you need any help. If you find a snake in your yard, don't panic. Just keep an eye on it. Give us a call. We will come out. We will keep you safe. We'll keep your dog safe and we'll relocate the snake.